Theme song. Welcome back. All right, I got a fucking story. Okay. And you know, a little something for the the ladies and the homos who listen. The story starts with me in the shower. Excellent. I like where this is going. Now I trained that day, so I you know burn up a mighty fucking heat and a sweat when I train. Mm -hmm. So it's a, it, I'm having my nice long shower. So that's you know you you open the pores with the training. You have a nice hot shower, keeps the pores open, you scrub yourself down, you use your fucking exfoliant, you fucking get out, and you let the ice cold air, or, you know, the relatively cooler air of, um, how do I get it? I got to teleport. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, I got to, I, I got to teleport. I'm not taking the fucking boat to home. Oh, yeah, 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 I forgot you had that. So. Transport! You're in the shower, pores are opening. Yeah, pores are opening, I'm showering off, blah, blah, blah. So I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm in there for a while, mm. is, is the operant fucking point. And I get out and I just, I, I walk back to my room, just did with the towel around my waist, because you let the cool air hit you and close your pores up. Very and nice, that helps yeah. your fucking skin. I get out of the shower, and there's just this Sudanese dude sitting on the kitchen table. And sitting on the kitchen table. Not on the kitchen table, just there. Okay, okay. Now, the thing about living in a share house is you can't just roll up on a cunt in your house because they might have a reason to be there. There are yeah. four other people who live in this place. I don't know everyone's fucking friends by eight degrees. So there's, you know, nine times out of ten, the strangers in the home have a reason to yeah. be there. So I can't just be like... So, you know, maybe, and, you know, I got friends that go to uni and do, like, engineering and shit, and half the time they've just got some weird fucking, you know, Planeteers collection of foreigners over fussing over a bit of, like, you know, soldering or whatnot. Mm. Alright. Oh, sweet. Oh, I've been there. Oh, waterfalls. I have a pretty bow. So, random fucking Sudanese dude. Now, within about five seconds of talking to him, I realized that he is drunk as fuck. And I mean, like, oh, what time of day is this? This is nighttime. So okay, this, is, this okay. is around about like fucking seven-ish, give or take, on a fucking you know, oh. Friday night. Has he's just—he's just wasted as fuck, and he's wandered into the house. Please no one knows him. He's just some random Holy drunk shit. dude who's just got in. And the crazy thing is, is like, you know, we got like cats in the house and shit, and one of them's a kitten, and she's not allowed outside. And the dude's closed the door. So like, it's like, oh, well that's nice of you to fucking wander randomly into what my home. Fuck? Yeah, just a random. And I don't know how long he was there. Cause like- No one does. Two of the house was out and you know, everyone, all the, you know, everyone's in their rooms fucking doing whatever the it's fuck. I've been having a long shower. Well, fortunately the door's closed. He was listening to your shower. Yeah, he was listening. He was absolutely listening to my shower. <laughs> and then it's just like, you have to go. And you know, someone in my house for nefarious reasons, that I understand. That I can punish. Just a dude randomly Yeah, like, there. just wankered. Like, and I mean, like, fucking retarded. Yeah. Like, talking to him was almost a waste of goddamn time, because it's like talking to someone who's, you know, got Down syndrome and then just doubled down on That's that fucking amazing. skill tree. Like, because it's, it's literally that bad. Like, I'm mm. just like, are you supposed to be here? <laughs> and I'm like... Did he even speak English? He spoke English, but, like... Between a thick accent and being drunk retarded, you may as well have not spoken English. Jesus. Like, I was barely able to pick up what the fuck he was going on. Like, how did you- like, are you supposed to be here? Was my first question. Like, are you supposed to be here? Are you? <laughs> huh? That's a- that's fucking amazing. Yeah, so there's- now I've just got- alright. Now I've got strange fucking drunk human in my house who's pro- like, he's not, like, second gen or anything. Like, the dude's, like, fucking fresh off the goddamn boat. So you're dealing with a situation where the guy doesn't have, you know, like these people come from like a village environment where yeah. you just talk just, to people. You just walk in. I'm an asocial prick from a city who hates talking to people he lives with and are friends with, let alone strangers. So these are two, like there's a lot clashing here. And none of it I can really just kick in the head. Like if this was someone, if, if I came out of my shower and there was just someone fucking tampering with my shit, Ah, I can just fuck him up. That's fine. That's easy. There's rules for that. But someone who's essentially a spastic child who's bumbled in from fucking yeah. some other country, you know, it's like That's different. A bit much to handle. It's different, yeah. So I'm like fucking after like as people hear me going, you're not meant to be in here. After all, other people are out. Now I can deal okay with someone drunk, you know, in my fucking house, because <laughs> I'm a large, you know, I'm a hundred kilos and I'm You're a big man. Yeah, so none of this is really that big an issue to me. But like, the women come out and now they're fretting. 
Because there's just a strange drunk dude in the house. And that's fair, because yeah. they're small. Oh, I've got fucking mail. Oh, that's right, I'm not allowed to look at my mail. You're supposed to be going to the village, by the way. Um, the human village? No, the Pascal's village, remember? Oh, yeah. That's, that's where right. we ended it. it, was like, you need to check on these nefarious robots. Alright. And now we're gonna be probably sad. Ah, uh, that's right, and they're not humans, are they? They're other they're androids. They're androids, yeah. Because everything's androids. We haven't seen any humans. The humans are gone. Yeah. Ooh, they fucking... Apparently we have to fish in the sewer and you'll find good things. Oh, well, that... That doesn't sound like what good life advice. Fish in the sewer? Um, what did you catch? It's, it's, Big it's a long fucking hair, turd. No, no, go back to the... You got the fast travel to it. Oh, that's right, yeah. Oh, I was wandering out here. Um, because I just completely forgot where I was in the game. I do like I'm too busy thinking about my fucking spontaneous Sudanese. I like how pretty this is. Like... So, like, he's just... Now I'm just fucking shepherding him out of the house. And... Like, you know, the women aren't adding anything to the situation, but like high tones, which just does not suit, because I don't, I don't want- know. Yeah, I don't want- for, you're not helping. Like, you're just adding stress to the situation when I'm fucking shoving him out the door enough, and if he does anything, then I can just yeah, belt exactly. him. And, you know, it's not like he's gonna fucking do anything, because he's like really tall and lanky and wasted. And those people are lucky to not just break their arms and legs in day-to-day -day mm -hmm. life. Let alone like trying to fucking hit the steady long legs of humans. Yeah, a small angry fucking nugget who's in his own home. Now I've gone away and put a singlet on because in my infinite wisdom I can't get this to a point where I'm wrestling a man out of my house bare ass fucking naked. <laughs> I didn't put pants on. I don't know why. I think That's... my thinking was I can't spend too much time just letting him go. Yeah, man. letting him bumble about my fucking yeah. home. But by the same token, if I'm gonna take the time to go fucking put a fucking singlet on, I could probably put some fucking pants on. I didn't put pants on, so I'm doing all this in a singlet and towel. So, you know, like, the problem is when you try to, you know, it's like dealing with a toddler. When you try to get a toddler to do A, they want to do B. Um, oh, Jesus. <laughs> so, at, after, at a certain point at the door, he's starting to want to do B. And I'm like, oh, like, look, this is, you know, I don't want to fucking... Belt the shit out of you, but at some point I'm losing patience with a stranger being in my fucking home. Yeah. Fortunately, he missed a step. Amazing. Now, my back stairs are steep as fuck. Yeah. They are also janky as fuck. And he steps down one, turns around to talk to me, goes to step down in the second one, misses it. Now, gravity fucking loves drunk cunts. I've seen people pass out while standing, and they almost do a flip, because their head it's is- their so head, good. Their head and upper body is quite heavy, and when you go completely limp, like puppet cut the strings, yeah. the fucking head just goes splat into the ground. This guy misses the step, and he's real fucking tall, because he's one of those fucking, like, you know, fucking Maasai jumping Sudanese dudes. He's like six foot, so he's like, he's just- he's got an arc that just carries him past all of the stairs. Amazing. So he misses every fucking step, and there's, at the bottom of the stairs, a big clay planter full <laughs> of what I like to call attempted jalapeno bush, which is really just dirt with some seeds I nudged into and I haven't fucking sprouted because apparently I bought shitty seeds. He hits this fucking thing like a pro wrestler through a table. Like, I, I, cause I, I'm watching and it's just, it's great to me cause I'm having fun now. I'm watching a man go <laughs> down the stairs. So he hits this fucking, it's like, the thing just goes, and, you know, now he's kind of like inadvertently broken shit, and I'm just sort of, you know, not in a mood. So I, I, I grab his like bag that he's got and left in the house and start like coaxing him out. Like, kind of, and I'm having to like lead him because he's just, I got a huge backyard. And he's just wandering about the back, and it's like, I can't have this guy ping ponging around the backyard for, you know, God knows how long. Because fuck, again, fuck knows how he got really in. Everything yeah. was closed, so he's closed shit behind him. And so I'm like, you know, the fucking people have called the cops now, and that's fair, because this guy needs to be picked up. Yeah. Like, sooner or later, he's gonna bundle in somewhere where some cunt's gonna just hit him with a rock. Oh, yeah. Um... So, you know, I fucking lured him out with a goddamn bag. And the police come by, and they're like, well, you know, he's, you know, a mess. And it's like, yeah... <laughs> no shit! Um, and he's he's like, in my he, house! Did he take anything? He's like, no, he didn't do anything. Like, that's the fucking, that's the fucking mind-breaking part. Is, you know, you can... I can deal with a cunt like, oh, I like walk in and some cunt's just trying to steal my fucking food or he's stealing my cheese out of my fridge. Oh, I can hit you. Yeah. But I can't just belt like a tod. And that's essentially what I was dealing with. So, you know, yeah, he's, he had an injury to his face and it's like, oh yeah, like check this shit out. And so they, the cops get the torch and shine it down and you can see like this amazing like sort of, you know, fucking six foot drop he's fucking taken. Like, you know, from well, top, the second yeah, floor yeah. to the ground floor onto concrete and through pottery. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, now my fucking jalapeno bush is never gonna fucking fruit unless, you know, smashed Sudanese are the most amazing fucking fertilizer. It might be. He might have blessed your I uh, Yeah, like, if I have blessed jalapenos, I'm gonna be hanging out in the Sudanese community, I'll tell you that. Because it's hard to get those jalapenos to sprout. 
So then he kind of like wanders off with the police find him and they're like, do you want to press charges? And it's like, well, not, I mean, not really, because he didn't take anything. And also, I don't think he knows where he is at all. Uh, and he's like, yeah, we doubt he'll be coming back. And I'm like, no, yeah, I don't, I don't think he will either. I think that's an issue. I just think you need to, you know, you get him out of here. Yeah, well, they took him to the hospital. That's a good Because he muddled himself up pretty bad on the fucking, oh, yeah, uh, on the pottery. But the good thing about like landing when you're drunk is, you know, you just, you hit the ground like very, very limp. Yeah. And you don't, you don't break shit as much as you think you would. I mean, there was a point where I kind of wanted to smack him in the head because it was just giving me the shits. But again, you know, you can't punch tards. And fuck, that's where this dude was. But it's just like that, you know, and now I get to go back inside and put on pants and that's the end of my fucking evening. And then, you know, it's cosmic. I sit down and tweet about it because you got it these days. Pascal. Pascal. Just imagine if you, you know, you came home, someone broke into your house, and they were just making, like, bacon and eggs. Yeah, like, and, uh, like, cause that shit does fucking happen, like, cause we, in the old house, we lived near, like, up the road from a halfway house. Mm. That was where you just hear people screaming cunt occasionally. Cunt. And every now and then, some, like, weird space unit would just walk in the front door, cause they think it's, like, the hallway of a halfway house, mm. cause they look kinda similar, like, except they all have locks on the doors and shit like that. And... You know, someone just walk in and go, Hey, get out, is Les around? And it's like, you're no, in the wrong no, house. Bro. And they're like, oh shit, sorry. And they just kind of like meander out. But then there were people around, you know? There was like a greeting process. Like, with fucking Walmart, but we actually filter out the ferals. But just like, get out of the shower. Like, you know, shirtless, expecting nothing but like, silence and cold to greet me. And there's just this kind of beaming Sudanese dude with eyes looking in two different directions. And it's like, that's, now I've got an issue. I've got an issue to deal with. And it's a weird issue, why couldn't it just be a simple issue? Like, it's an issue where I have to be, like, strangely fucking patient and friendly with the mom. You gotta head to the forest through the commercial district. There's the commercial district. I have no right, fucking clue. Select's not map, Gabriel, you gotta learn this. So, you know. Alright, that's the person's memories. Oh, that looks like it. Uh, looks like it. Yeah, well, how the fuck do I get there? Where's the? Can I teleport to there? Nope. It's question marks. Damn you, question marks! Uh, city ruins center. Okay. Oh, it's across that bridge, dude. Remember when you went across that oh, bridge? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The big dude was there. All right, so I go to city ruins cave, and then I wander out, and I go across, and I pick a fight with the big dude. Yeah, that was my fucking day. It's just like fucking, you know. Sudanese adventures. Surprise! Spontaneous Sudanese. Yes, yes, Just yes. in the house. <laughs> in the house in is the, the house. most baffling thing. Like, again, he shut the door though, you know? Like, everything, like... He probably was like, oh, animal, animal cannot get out. Yeah, it's just, uh, but, uh... City Ruins now was... Cave. Cave, yeah. Why are they so far away from the other city? Fucking goddammit. it! <laughs> not even gonna fucking bother. I don't even teleport. They just I store want a damn body. Android Lolita vending machine. Low leaders, bro leaders, we got the leaders for all of you. Faux leaders? Faux leaders. That's just a woman. It's just an adult woman in a fucking maid outfit. <laughs> you can't fool me! <laughs> Alright? That's how that's how low leaders are measured. Leaders. That's, that's how we yeah. They're not actually Lolita's not actually one word, it's low leaders. Yeah. You know, if you've got so many liters of low, then a unit of moist. That's right. Up we go, and up we go. You know, I'm kind of glad she has pants on again. Too distracting? A little. Alright, where is... Alright, look, am I allowed? Oh, watch yeah, out for the worms! Ah, uh, yeah, those fucking things suck. No, go away. Alright, hold up. Where am I in relation to everything here? Um... Alright, yeah, there we go. So basically, keep going straight. Yeah, straight ahead. Alright. Deja vu! I've just been on the plane before, higher in the street. But I wasn't wearing pants, and you know, that's... Because I'll wrestle a dude out of my house buck fucking naked, because they're going to come off worse. Oh yeah. Well, right. <laughs> if uh, I have to have I will... sex with a dude to get him out of my house, I will. I, yeah, will. I will fucking ensure that they come off worse. Get the nuts in your face. Eat them. Eat the nuts. My nuts are touching your chin. That means I'm the victor. It does. That's, you know... That's literally like, you know, rules from like ancient times. 
Because if you've got your balls on somebody, you've essentially won that dispute. Yeah, you keep going right there. Yeah, I just- I get turned around, and not a lot of this is very distinct. See that little point on the map there? Yeah. The big one, that's where you're going. Well, yeah, but I don't want to, like... You know, you can't just, as the crow flies this shit, you you know, there's... There's, like, lumps in the way and stuff. There's, like, landscape and shit. Right, I think it's over there. It is. I think Whee! there was- there was a graphical update, like, for the gra graphic mod I used to make this actually work properly. There was an update before we started. Is it just me, or does the game look a slight bit better? I don't know. My eyes can't see over 30 FPS, I don't know what's going on. My eyes can't see over 20, that's why I play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time with PAL. Uh, no, no. That, it runs at 20 frames. Yeah. No, this is why I'm really hoping Citra gets a little better, because you cannot play fucking Majora's Mask in any suitable way, except for on the 3DS. You gonna fight him or you gonna run? Where is he? Is he even no, here? Or is he, he gone? was to your right last time. Nothing's like you know bothering me though, so I don't know what the fucking big deal is. Well, he seems to be gone. Maybe huh. he's just there to deter you from coming here early. He wasn't a very good deterrent though, because he was just a really tall tube dude, and you know you I could run away from him. The only reason I didn't fucking stick it out is because I didn't want to get in a fight. But you know I wasn't doing any damage. This place looks nice. It does. Really fucking does. All right, can I? No. Nah. Nothing can. Nothing in this world you can use. That'll be for fucking Brolita for later. Brolita. Because apparently the second time you play through, you get to play as Brolita. Yeah. And then there's like a third. Thing apparently that's gets the end story. of Evangelion levels. That does not surprise me in the slightest. Like I. You know, we, we were there already. I know. We're at robots fucking and producing perfect androgynous Japanese men. Like, that's... It does not get much more. Like, if we get some daddy issues thrown into the mix... Ah, oh, you're laughing. Did you just say there's a, there's a daddy dating game coming out? No. I fucking teleported. Literally, no, seriously, it's no. A, it's a dating sim, but just for dads. Like, they're gay dads. <laughs> I don't think this is for dads. I think this is for gays that like dads. No, I don't mean it's for dads. I'm just saying oh. the characters in the game, they're like daddies. You know? Fucking god damn it, gays. <laughs> like, you know. I don't, like, people, like, again, you know, people bitch and shit about, like, the straight fucking gays and stuff, but it's like, all you other people are fucked too. Don't play, like, what do you want? Daddies. Okay. These ones are a bit higher level. Oh god. We know what happens when they run away. Where are you going? I just want to see where this goes. It's gonna be plot device, that's where it goes. Alright, no, well, you're not doing anything. I'll shoot you in the back, I don't care. I'm like the police. Say hello to Scroto! What the fuck? Ah! Fuck no! <laughs> I wasn't ready. What's it talks. Oh, God, it talks. It. It's a little boy. Hey there, guys. What's up? This seems no. weird, to be. <laughs> Let's kill it. Wait, what? I agree. I agree. <laughs> yeah, nine. I'm, I'm with nine S on the genocide. Okay. What? It made comical whiz noises. I can't deal with this. <laughs> Spontaneous Sudanese did not prepare me for this shit. Also, oh, Bolo can get through this crap. Cause this, I read, I read up on this. This game's the sequel to a fifth ending of a sequel to a game that was essentially Dynasty Warriors. Are you shitting me? No. That's where fucking Nier comes from. It, there was one of the hidden endings of fucking Drakengard or whatever too, was something to do with the future. And this is the fucking carry on from that. Holy fuck. And like, because apparently like fucking Angus has played this, which kind of fits. Because apparently the guy who makes these is insane and a bit of a dick, which I really appreciate both. Um, because like... You know, it's, 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 the game's a lot like Dynasty Warriors, mm. hack and slash. Like, I looked it up on YouTube and I'm like, how the fuck are these two things related? But, like, the boss is like a five minute DDR thing, but with, you know, the control pad. And then at the end, there's like a 30 second silence and then one last beat that you gotta push the thing for. Like, the game's just a huge giant fuck you. Oh, shit! Alright. I wanna. You just be careful. I will, 2B. 
This is um pretty nuts, eh? I like where this is going. All right, look, where's how do I got like little? Where'd my fucking on the Good pod? Droid. Just left and right. No, I'm like you know where my fucking. Cause I had the droid. I'm fucking look. I'm pushing fucking warp. Can I not get away from that? Hmm. Continue. Yeah, I'm kind of curious as to what I could change the message to. Did it say change mission? I thought it said change message. I swear it was mission. No, because I think when you die, you're allowed to, like, write down, like, what happens. But I'm, I'm guessing it's pre-coded stuff. I'm not allowed to write, like, poopy poo ha, -ha. <laughs> I find a way, though. Life finds a way. It's like, Angus always puts visions of bleeding butthole as the message in. You can do that? Hmm? Is it doing anything? What the fuck is this? Oh, okay. <laughs> well, game. You didn't say loading or anything. Don't blame us. Kuma, go away. Booting system. Boot, boot. We got company. Looks okay. Like um. Yeah, really? What the fuck? Where am I? What's going on? You're back in the cave. Oh, okay. Why do I get spawned on jerks? I think that's what happens when you die. Oh, okay. Because that's locked now, because they're attacking it. Oh. What the fuck you dudes? Yeah, that's right. Alright, because you need to go back to get your body to get all your shit now, too. Ah, oh, big butter. Away from my fucking things. Wussy Whirlawind, you're winding it. Why is it so hard for me to say Wussy Whirlwind? There we go. English is hard. How many of these fuckers are there? Oi. I think there's more than there were a minute ago. There is. I don't know why. There's a game mate playing around. I think you're nearly there. Let's more spawn again. Nice! Alright, look, fucking thank you. Target the dudes. Because, like, some of them you can interrupt, and it's like, ah, oh, good oh, that's the, you know, end of that attack. Alright, look, fuck off. I'm kind of bored of you dudes. I got like a forest full of weird robot jerks. Oh, fuck's sake. Why are they all broken circuits? That's a bit. A bit crafty. Do you get it? Fuck you. <laughs> um, You're in the right spot. Yeah, no, I was. Um, I just wanted to activate it again so it, you know. I didn't know if I didn't activate it, if it would, you know, register or whatever the fuck. Hmm. Bunker, if you're gonna use your missiles, switch them, the switch them now. Yeah, that's what I was, it's like, you know, like up uh, or left. About that, Go on. The there you go, block missile. Machine life forms were there we go. They know that facility is one of our network terminals. Yeah, but that's not all. While they knew it was connected to our network, they didn't try to destroy it. I wonder if you if you lose your like equipped chips and stuff as well. They're getting smarter Probably. Thank you. Huh. I'll be sure to share that would suck. the Council of Humanity on the moon. A little chip thing seems to be flashing, I don't know. That was that was the buffs you had from um Oh, so those activate the second Yeah. Uh, it's okay. a very temporary buff. Alright. Well, I wasn't expecting them to be like permanent, but I thought they I, I thought I had to like select or use them or some shit. Uh, they're just like, oh yeah, let's let's go. Oh yeah, nah. Knock it off. Hooray. <laughs> Alright, look. Let's get up the fucking tree. Tree power. I like the environment. Environment's nice. You know, I like the after humans stuff. Yeah. People are gone, it's just androids and fuckbots. <laughs> I, like, I do love that as a solution, you know. Robots have taken over. What do we do? Build more robots? 
Fucking... These ones will help us. Why? <laughs> yes, they will. We built them. Didn't We're you? We're not build... gonna team up and make fucking you know perfect androgynous fucking Asians or whatever. Oh, get the moose. Crazy moose, loose in the hoose. Ah, <laughs> uh, look, you jerks. I'm trying to fight moose. Moose. You should also go to the left. There's a, another vending machine just right there. Yeah, right, yeah, because this would be like right at the bridge. Yeah, fuck off, you little bastards. Analysis: Non-functioning transporters can result in serious limitations to data uploading and other vital mission activities. You don't fucking say. Quickly as possible. Understood. What are you going on about? Can I touch it now? Yes. Hooray! So I'll get shit out of this one if I die again. I think so. Uh, I think that's on. how it works. I feel like that's how it should work. I wish I got shot out of a vending machine if I died. It'd make life convenient. <laughs> just like, build me a Bioshock like Vita chamber. I... That just reminds me of just at the very end of like... Oh, he's back. Oh, well, fuck. Just go past him. Like, dude, he's... Right! <laughs> <laughs> he's spazzing out. I bet you can't get me from under here. Hmm. But he fucking comes in. Yeah, alright, I'm making a move. Gotta follow. Do you have to fight all this again or I is it gonna be so. open? Hey, look at that. Okay, does it dump my ass right back, you know, where I fucking lay? I think that's it on the map, the blue, yeah, the blue um, marker by the look of it. That's where I'm. That's where so I'm I would run, pick that up, and then scoot and like yeah, assess. see if you can quickly. Because I was a cat, because I can't, like, it's a. You know. It, oh, just, there they are. Uh, Well, you seem to be doing effective damage to them. Oh, they're coming. Oh, they're fucking off. Oi. Fuck you, then you're going. Aha. I have one. It is separated from the pack. Well, he gives no fucks. He's Aquaman! Tried and rushing you. I also worked out why Aquaman's Trident Rush falls out all the time. Why? You've got to double tap forward after it huh. to move him forward. Or you can tap, double tap back to move him backwards. Oh, okay. Alright, well there, there, there we have the fucking... Look, piss off, you squatted dicks. Don't forget your laser. This reminds me of Shadow of the Star, you know, like... Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, where you going? Where you going? I don't know. You ain't shit! You think you're a badass? Fucking, I... I hate stuff not having hits done. I hate when people can just move through my shit. Fucking Ghibli 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 Tufts. Ghibli Tufts. Like, look, I just... Ooh. There it is. Hmm. Hmm. Scoot! Are you riding a... What is he riding? A robot dog? Or like... <laughs> I'm trying to get a good... I think it's like a guy who's been converted. Well, I guess we'll never know. Alright, so check your... check your equips. Make sure you get... <sighs> I said just put everything back where it was. Yeah, it's all right. I still think spear shit. Everything else does so much better damage. Yeah. Oh, fucking. What can I do here? No. Just looking at it. Uh. <laughs> oh god, there's a castle. I'm just so concerned at what, what I'm gonna find. Just remember, we were chasing a ball head. Ah, oh, I forgot. I know. I know you did. <laughs> I was in a place where it was just fucking robots. Now there's not. The robots have ball heads inside them. There's some boars. Oh, life choices. Hmm. Animals got tough while humans went away. I think it's worth it, bro. 
Well, there's a fucking thing, like... Oh, you need the hides, yeah. Well, I'm not worried about the hides, I mean, I would like the hides, but I also want this, you know, shit. Out of the way, villagers! <laughs> Get away from a science machine. Alright, guys. Next time, game's gonna find some ball heads. Keep it classy is proudly sponsored completely by its fans. We thank you for your support. <laughs> it expanded somehow.